first singles off my new record are Here's to Never Growing Up and latest one is called Rock and Roll. The rock and roll music video is quite eventful. I wanted to do something different, so I shot it in the middle of the desert. Danica McKellar stars in the video and she's my partner in crime and we're on a mission to save rock and roll and Billy Zane is also in the video and I have my first on-screen kiss with Danica. My first on-screen kiss was, <laughs> it was fun. It was with a girl and we were like, aha, this is funny. So we had a good time. With this record, I worked with all new people. So different co-writers, Chad being one of them and David Hodges, Jay Cash, Martin Johnson. Chad and I got together to, to work and to write and then we became really good friends and then eventually later on it turned into something else which was really cool. So now we're married. <laughs> I think we're constantly always going to be talking about music, writing songs, coming up with ideas together because that's what we both do and you put two people together that do that and it's just never ending. So I think what's really cool about us falling in love is that it was natural and there was a friendship first and it was all around kind of during the making of my record and so it was really romantic because he proposed in the studio. And Chad and I have a duet together so I'm really looking forward to the fans hearing this one. This is my fifth album and so basically it's, it's self-titled and when you hear the record all the way through it's, it's diverse. It sounds like a lot of my music from before, like all my styles are, are in this record, but there's also a departure where I've experimented with new sounds and styles and tried different different stuff. Um, there's ballads, there's piano songs, just piano and vocal. It's Marilyn Manson um, performs on, on the rock song Bad Girl With Me. We always have kept in touch throughout the years, and I had this song, this track, and I was listening to it, and it made me think of him, so I called him up, and he, he he came to the studio and he liked it and he put some vocals on it so um, it's actually one of my favorite songs on the record. So the record is now on pre-sale, it's up for sale on uh, iTunes and the official release date is November 5th.